German. It's astounding how fast you can move. Thank you, thank you. You know, maybe I should have my own catchphrase. German. Faster than a speeding bull. Uh, never mind, never mind. <laughs> Thanks for letting me use your new technology to watch you on other planets. This is great for my research. It's all good. Maybe having an audience while I'm on my missions can be fun. So, is there any luck finding that murderous alien? Not yet. But with all the attacks that have been happening around here, I'm sure he'll show up eventually. While you're there, can you perhaps bring me back some samples of that world so I can study? Sure. That's no problem. I'm certain there's some vials of alien genetics around here somewhere. German, can I ask you something? What's it like when you're out there flying in outer space? Impossible. Or at least that's the word I'd use to describe it if I were human. I mean, sure, I have to do it so I can recharge my cosmic radiation. When I'm out there, I feel like I'm at peace. Passing by so many worlds, seeing the stars, yellow stars, red stars, blue stars, stars galore. <laughs> Being out there is, is really something else. Although, you do have to watch your back when you're out there. I should have expected that. I really, really hate energy eaters. But listen, okay? No matter what, you're gonna pay for what you've done. But I'm just gonna give you the chance to. Oh! Ooh! Oh! Careful, Jarman. Yeah. Good luck with me being careful, <laughs> but something tells me I might want to end this before it gets too ugly. Nice shot, Jarman. You almost had me worried there for a moment. Whew, yeah. I almost had myself worried for a minute there. But. They don't call me the strong one for nothing. But uh, once I get this guy back to the space police, I'm gonna go ahead and head back to Earth. When you get back, you should stop by my office in case you wanna hear more about my research. Oh, most definitely. But I'm gonna go check on Jamin first when I get back home. Something tells me he's still a little tipped about what happened between him and his old flame the other day. What's up, bro? Jarman, what are you doing here? Well, I was just getting back in town from, you know, saving the cosmos and all that good stuff. When I saw y'all there. Pretty much playing hero again to people you don't know. <laughs> Jarman, Jarman, Jarman. <laughs> Always the cynic. There's nothing wrong with helping those that can't help themselves. We have all of our Zanarian gifts. You might as well put them to good use. That's so. I wouldn't exactly call being a Zonarian a gift. Torians. That's why I already don't like them. Well, I'm assuming they didn't just show up here to trade insults with us. You'd be right. I came to warn you to stay away from Star Ember. Excuse me? There's much you do not understand. Man, you ain't gotta tell me nothing. 
I already get sick of that overdramatic wannabe Amazon star Amber anyways. Who are you to tell us to stay away from Vela? Vela of Torin has no business associating with the likes of you two. We just want Star Amber to be safe while she's here on Earth. And I don't. And FYI, Star Amber wouldn't be associating with us in the first place if she was still on Torrent. Get him. Watch it. Aren't you guys from the same Torrent that blasted Vela from her home? Get him. Took her away from everything she's ever known and loved. Get him. <laughs> Friends like you, who needs enemies? Woohoo! Damn! You need some ointment for that one, man. I hate to agree with my brother, but he is right, you know. Quiet! Oh, you be quiet! You better recognize who you're talking to! You know what? Enough of this talking. Let's throw them hands! <laughs> oh. I want the strong one. It's not the time for this, Gallic. No, Lilia. It's time I make Jarman stay away from Star Amber. <laughs> As usual, you Torian solve all your problems with your fist. So be it. You fool! You think you're worthy of Vela? Over my dead body. You are so lucky I'm yeah. not my brother. Otherwise, I would make you eat those words. Man, they still fighting? Wait, where'd you get the water from? The rest of it, you might want to get back. Hmm? Ah! Ah! Stand down, get back up, and I'll knock your head off his shoulders. Enough! You've proven your point! You know, on a technicality, your friend started it in the first place, right? Yes, and this fight is over. This is not over! Gallic! Listen, despite our differences, ultimately, we want the same thing. And that's the safety of Ayla. We all care for her all the same. Speak for yourself! Your words mean nothing to me. This is not over. So next time, be prepared. Oh, I will. And next time, I'll have another uppercut and a boom clap waiting for you. You know you should have killed him and ripped his head apart, right? A part of me actually kind of wanted to, but you know it's not my stop. I really, really don't like that guy, but it takes more strength to show restraint. If you say so, but you better warn your little star Amber, and next time, if he gets on my bad side, I'm ripping his damn head off. 